Hello guys, it's Skepicad once again with Western Survival. In this particular video, we're actually going to make an update on on the issue on the cold and hot areas. Now I'm going to go to the cold area here, and I have only taken water and normal um, meat here. These are the easiest ingredients to actually make. This one right here doesn't written that they're actually giving you extra protection on on uh, the hot and cold areas, but you are actually in cable uh, on traveling to these particular areas and uh, not needing those special ingredients that I was talking about last time. It is the warm uh, stew that you needed uh, for actually being in this particular area. That's the best ingredients. But you're still in cable of going to this area here and still have some protection. So the Northern Lake, for example, that's a cold area. It's a very cold area and we're going to freeze our butt to death here uh, if we don't have any food or drinks on us. But we're actually in cable of, of still uh, doing this. You can see right here is it's cold and oh my god, look at this. And now we're going to eat something. That's actually giving him a chance for going around. So the only thing you need is actually just eat something. You don't need special kind of food, like I said in the last video, but those special kind of food are actually giving you the best protection in the longest time in these areas. That's the difference in it. So that's that's the difference. You're incapable of having two on, you're not incapable of having two of the same on. So remember, you need to, to uh, make a change on that. You're incapable of having food and of course, water on the same time. So that's the difference again. Remember, you can have more than one thing. And I do recommend you do that because this water right here is just giving you 20 extra in healing. And it's also giving you 20 extra in healing with just this simple food. So these simple ingredients here are actually going to make it easier for you to run around. So if you're gonna look at our hat here, uh, this hat here actually have an extra on 0 0.5 on, on a, uh, the cold area, so let's just take off all this co uh, clothes, guys. And this guy is still in cable of running around in this area. That will normally not happen if you were in cable of doing it uh, without this food here. To make this kind of food here, you just need this one. And yeah, you can make that on, on the fireplace. And that's actually the only ingredients you really want to have. So you can run around but freaking naked here and do exactly having fun. In this area, and you are not incapable of doing that in the old version, so that's actually a good thing in this new uh, version. But remember, this one right here, of course, is going to give you extra protection as well. So, I do recommend you have clothes on, guys. And the only thing for you guys just to know the newest update it is okay just having these kind of ingredients here. You don't have need to have special, like I said in the last video. Sorry about that. Uh, but I'm just going to show you guys just to make sure that you understand that the special kind of food, oh my God, just popping up here. The special kind of food that I was talking about was this one right here, uh, this uh, hot stew here, where do we have it? This warming wild stew, this one. That's gonna give you the maximum of cold protection on five. And for the hot areas, the maximum of protection is the iced tea. So that's also five. So that's just the difference in it. But you're still incapable of just using any kind of food. It doesn't need to be this one. This is the cheapest food to actually make. And then you're ready off in those areas. So for you guys that want to go in these areas, remember just have some food and drinks, guys. That's going to boost your uh, health and it's going to boost your way of actually being capable of traveling in these areas. Remember, they're having a cool down. Uh, Every uh, thing you drink and eat have a cool down on 30 minutes, so you're actually incapable of running around uh, in these areas and collecting those items you want. Uh, I do recommend if you guys are going for iron, this is the best, uh, not this one, sorry, <laughs> Iron Mind is the best area for actually looting that. I'm still uh, working my butt up for getting the Alliance up and running. I do hope that we're incapable of getting the safe up and running very, very soon and the card itself so that I can start actually producing some of these uh, gold knuckles for us uh, at this Alliance. Uh, so that's gonna be the news in, in the next couple of videos. I really want to go through the aliens itself. If you, any of you guys have any question in this particular game, please write that in comment, and I'll try to make sure to make a video on that. I'm not gonna make an update every day on on these small changes, but uh, every time there's a change in this particular game, I really want to show you guys how to do it the best way. So I hope you guys understand to go to the uh, cold area. You don't need any kind of special uh, clothes on. You can go butt naked like you saw I was doing right there. 
the only thing you need is have to eat some kind of food it doesn't matter if it's any kind of special food like i said but you just need these kind of simple uh, food ingredients so hope you guys enjoyed this see you guys next time i'm cubby please subscribe to my channel and give this video a like bye bye guys